We hope that you'll enjoy this episode. Just a reminder to subscribe to our channel and like this video. Thank you for joining us for another Let's Play session. So we are playing State of Decay, Decay 2. We've just been working through, you know, some missions. Um, we, you know, we've established an outpost. We've got this, um, we've also got this little base here. But we need, you know, building materials to build it up. Um, so what I'm going to focus on is clearing, you know, a couple of houses and just kind of practicing gameplay, you know. So I'm still pretty new to this game, so trying to, trying to figure those pieces out. We've got some areas that are closer to us. Um, so I'm gonna go clear those and try to gather some resources. I have <laughs> not been terribly successful, I guess, um, overall, but um, every little bit here will help. Uh, I do know that the fatter Zeds are not very sneak friendly, but every um, you know, every encounter I learn something a little bit different. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna keep working here. Okay. Found a good spot to search for materials. Should this really be our priority right now? Safety at home is always a priority. So at some point I'm going to get into this big fighting match, but I'm trying to save as much of my weapon um, durability as I can. And in doing so, um, hopefully preserve my life a little bit better. I'm just going to keep picking these off one at a time until they notice me, I guess. And I'll circle away on this building, I'm sure. Oh, there was a back way in. Okay. Oh. Okay, I did not see that Zed. Oops, it says site secure, so I guess that means all of the Zeds are... Oh, guess not. Building materials. There we go. Okay. And while we're here, we'll just search the rest. We can always come back for for more. Shut off my light. Not sure if that attracts Zeds or not, um, but I'm not gonna take a chance till I know. Okay. Let's drop off our rucksack here, and then I think we can go clear at least one more uh, building. All right, so let's run down there and grab uh, some fuel. I'm sure we'll run into some uh, some Z's on the way and um, practice our stealth kills. We'll see. Functional car over here. Obviously, that's not the case. So there's the gas. And in previous versions, you could, I thought, like break apart these. But I really want to save the gas here, so let's. Not really what I was hoping for. A little bit of gas there. Looks like another gas that we can carry. Let's double check that we had grabbed everything from inside here while we're here. After I turn on my flashlight, because going into a dark room would be kind of stupid. Looks like there's more, more gas even there. Okay, so. We have a couple of different gas runs that we can do here, but I want to ensure that I'm getting the most out of every one of these runs. So I'm actually going to come over here. This almost looks like a working truck. Is that a working truck? That'd be awesome if it was. Please, please, please be working. Mm, nope. It does not look like it is. Oh, well. All right. Let's scout this little whatever this is here. See if there's anything of use. Just again, get the most out of all of our little trips here. Don't see any any Zeds. Food outpost. Okay.
All right, so we have room here. I need to figure Where out I put this? how to break this open, I think. That's what I probably want to do, but... Um, let's see. So we'll drop this one. We will pick up this one. We will break this one open. That gives us some food. Then we will re-pick up our gas. There we go. Might as well, I guess, claim this site, seeing as we're here. Oh, we don't have enough uh, influence. All right, for the sake of you know getting a little bit more action in, I'm going to try to stealth kill these and probably end up in some big uh, some big fight. Kind of knew that could have ended badly. <laughs> My bad. All right, so um, back up to our main base, but at least we got to kill a few Zeds while we were on our way. Success in sneaking up on it. So I'm going to try. I think it's going to result in me getting bit, um, but just to kind of show that it's different than the others seems to be harder to sneak up on, but we'll see. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, no, I am wrong. All right. So I guess I'm just not as good of a, a stealth fighter as I had thought I was. All right. So, running back up to our base. Go ahead and set this and drop off our fuel. The next piece is going to be to drop off any materials that we had found. Which just gives us further influence, I believe. And, you know, we had collected that building materials, so let's go ahead and see what we have that we can do here. So, workshop, or kitchen, or sheltered bed. So what do we have? We've got storage, we've got storage, we've got a place to park, an infirmary, a command center, and a watchtower. So I think a workshop would make since so I'm gonna go ahead and build that. I like the idea of fixing broken weapons, so well Okay, here is our workshop. Repair or salvage weapons. Let's repair our weapon. So let's repair our gun, I think that would be wise. Repair our machete. Also think that would be wise. All right. So collecting those parts, I guess, is pretty important. Um, so I'm glad that we collected those. So our machete's back to full health. So is our uh, weapon. I think uh, let's go ahead and reload that. There we go. So we're locked and loaded. Uh, we don't have a whole lot of ammo, but we try to avoid using it. So that's okay. Um, all right, so we've been pretty successful, I think, in this uh, you know this run. Uh, join us as we continue to expand and gather more uh, materials and uh, you know outposts. So thank you.